I don't know if this will fix everything because when you look at how the Bengals, how bad, like they, they've been playing the first two weeks of the season, we had uh, Teddy Bruschi on yesterday, and he mm -hmm. talked about how a lot of teams now, they're going to get off to, we're going to see a lot of teams off to slower starts because of how little time that a lot of the starters get in the preseason. Okay, so maybe you give them a little bit of a pass and say the first week was a bit of an, an, an anomaly. Andy Dalton can't be that bad. And then upon seeing this, and I know he struggled primetime Andy Dalton, right. struggled against this the team defense, in yeah. particular, but at this stage in his career, Andy Dalton shouldn't be at this point. He shouldn't look like he's regressing. And I don't know if that's something that an offensive coordinator can fix. It wasn't all on him last night, all right? But this, he shouldn't look this bad. You know what an offensive coordinator can't do? Block. You know what yep. an offensive coordinator can't do? Stand and deliver under pressure. Okay, right. so they're lost right now. They're collectively lost, and they're searching for answers. Like Marvin Lewis, the organ I, I mentioned about the organization. Marvin Lewis has never fired a coordinator during the season. So for him to do this tells me that somebody with as much job security as he's had in Cincinnati is searching for answers. And Bill Lazor, good luck. Good luck. In pr he can't bring the guys you let go back. Right. And what he can, he also can't do is bring this fr what seems like a fractured team. I get that they were – Emotional after the game last night. Yeah, based night. off their comments. With AJ yeah, Green, Drake, Pac Man Drake Jones. Kirk, uh, Drake Kirkpatrick. You know what it is? Yeah. This, this whole thing is just kind of stale. Yeah. You know, they had so much pressure and, and so much disappointment that just piled up and piled up over the years in the postseason, and it's stale. And you know what happens after it, it gets stale? It gets sour. And you know what happens after it gets sour? It stinks. And right about now, offensively especially, they stink. So this seems like the beginning of the end for the Bengals as we've come to know them, having never gotten over that playoff. I just wonder how much longer – Andy Dalton is going to be able to hold on to his job. I mean, you have A.J. McCarron right behind him, somebody who's going to be a free agent. At some point, again, Andy Dalton may not be the problem, but if he's not the solution, how do you resist the temptation to go to A.J. McCarron? Just, just as you said, much like firing your coordinator so you can get That's something, fall, a guys. fresh breath of fresh air.